Aim down. Go, 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 like, <clears throat> I'm not even sure that was a whopper penny. Talk about that, we could talk about this. Talk about that, we could talk about this. Talk about that. Anthony's unfiltered. Hey y'all, and welcome back to my channel. I'm your girl Anthony, and you are here on Anthony's.com. Welcome, welcome, welcome back to all my A-listers. Hey girl, hey. And if you are new, hello, how are you? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and you can be a part of the A-list too. Y'all, it is Sunday, June 23rd. And y'all, it is hot. I'm still in Jacksonville. It is hot. Hold on. Let me answer this phone. He hung up. Um, it is hot, hot, hot. Y'all, today is June 23rd. It is my baby daddy's birthday. I hate calling him my baby daddy. My kid's dad's birthday. If you are new here, my kid's dad passed away in November. So this is his first birthday of him not being here. And we are headed to the graveyard to do a balloon release for him. Um I, I, I have so many mixed feelings about this whole situation. Um, I don't know. I just, I don't know. But we headed to the graveyard to do a balloon release for him. And then we're probably going to go to his mom's house or something. It's just so much, y'all. It's just so much. I just, I don't know. Let's just talk about something else. I don't know. I just want to come on here honestly and kick off the vlog. And... I'll check back in with y'all a little bit. Good morning, y'all. So it is Monday, um, June 24th. Um, I think the package is finally coming today, y'all. So I'll be going home either tomorrow or Wednesday. Um, y'all, so yesterday after we left the graveyard, we ended up going to my kids' grandma house. Um, we had crabs, we just sat around, you know, told stories about my baby daddy and just really just had a good time. His family, um, one of his brother's mom, I mean, one of his other son's mom, um, and all of his kids and stuff. So we had a really good time. I stayed over there till about nine o'clock last night. Then I came back here, took me a shower. By that time, I was beat between that son out there and then they eating crabs and all of that. Baby, I was toe down, okay? So I came here and took me a shower, went to bed. I'm up now, I have a doctor's appointment this morning. Um, so I'm about to go to the doctor. Um, I gotta get some blood work done, so and I think it's supposed to be fasting, so I'm not gonna eat anything before I go out the door. But I am dressed and ready to go, so let's get out of here. All right, y'all, we done made it back in the house. So, left my daughter's appointment. I ended up going to the house and getting me a sub. One thing y'all do know about me, I'm gonna get me a sandwich, baby. I am gonna get me a sandwich, but I went to the house because I wasn't going to the house. I went to the house because one of my friends told me that it was free sub day. If your name start with an A, W, X, or Y. But it wasn't really the A, it was the X, W, and Y. So it's like A and X, W. I don't know how to explain it, but it wasn't no A. So I didn't have the paper for it. But I wonder how he got it anyway, because y'all know, like I said, if I'm doing that, that's an email sandwich. Um, So I'm back. What about you? Yep. He used Give him some alarm. You're going to be going on that holiday no, not just one shed. We, you just had you get ready to get some. Um, yeah, but y'all know I'm gonna eat me a sandwich, so I didn't mind. I went ahead and I um, I went ahead and bought me a sub. So that was lunch, y'all. I am sleepy. I'm tired. Um, I have not been taking my naps, but today on today, June 24th, the day of the Lord, baby, we finna lay down. I got some. I gotta go later, so. I'm finna rest right now into that, and I'll talk to y'all in a minute. 
Good morning. Y'all, it is, I don't know where my earrings at. It is Tuesday morning, June 25th. Remember I told y'all I thought the package was coming yesterday? The package did not come. I'm still in Jacksonville. Um, worst case scenario, I think I'll be leaving on Thursday, though. It's Tuesday. I should be leaving on Thursday. Um, I had some family that was coming up to where I'm at on Thursday anyway, so I might just ride back with them. So, we don't know, but I'm headed out the door. I gotta go get some blood work done. I know y'all probably think, girl, you don't have more doctor's appointments than anybody I know. I know, right? It seemed like I done been to the doctor so many times, but I told y'all that I scheduled all of my appointments like this, so to me, just to make sure I have a year before I need anything else done, so by that time I can have all my stuff like switched over and everything. So, this is just the blood work for the doctor's appointment. So, I'm headed to actual to a Quest location to get my blood work done. Um, It's fasting, so... I'm about to get me some water and get out this door. I just want to stop in and say, hey, y'all, these lashes, like, the lashes on this eye, I think I got, do I have any? One. This eye, I got, still got all these. And I was going to make me a lash appointment for when I get back home, but, um, being that I didn't know exactly when I was going back home, I didn't. But I know for sure I'll be back next week, so I think I'm going to do that today. Make an appointment for like the 3rd or the 4th or something like that. Right before 4th of July. So, yeah. Let me grab me some water. Y'all, I got me a standing cup yesterday. Got my first standing cup. It's pink. <sighs> Someone bought a pumice. So I had to take what they gave me. But, y'all know I'm not a pink girl. But, we gonna work with this pink cup. So, I'm gonna put some water in that. So, I can take that out the door with me. And, yeah. Let's go. Y'all, it's me and Walmart trying on clothes. So I'm supposed to be doing my blood work. The quest is inside the Walmart, but I drank water and I wasn't supposed to. So I gotta wait an hour before I can do my blood work. So I decided to come in here and draw some clothes on. So here we are. <laughs> That's the next dress. Here's some cute little summer dresses just to throw on. Let's have something to throw on real quick. They had this in pink, green, black um a couple of different colors it's large all right y'all this is the same dress it's just a bigger size because i grabbed the bigger size first and then i thought about oh well let me try it in different color in different size but as you can see the bigger size has a lot of room in it so I, if i would get it i would get it in that size which is the extra large not the two x but this is that Alright y'all, this is the final thing, this little dress. Y'all know I love these kind of dresses. It's so nice and so cool. It has pockets. It sways like this. It just feels so... I might get this, y'all. See, this ain't what I came in here for. But I actually really like this. What y'all think? What y'all think? Alright y'all, so... I ain't got number a few, but I'm sure it ain't my size. It ain't. This would have been so cute. The watermelon. Oh, I'm mad about that. I wonder can I find watermelon shorts online? But they got my size and tops. And both of the tops, they just don't have the shorts. And now I wear me a two-piece outfit from Walmart, but this right here is too far in the trenches. That's that's too far in the trenches, but man, we ain't doing that. Nah. That's just going a little too far. So we gonna see the kind of graphic tees, what they got going on with this. All right, y'all, it is, what day is Tuesday? It's still Tuesday. I talked to y'all earlier when I was um leaving from doing my blood work. And then I ended up going to Firehouse and get me a sub. I told y'all that the level of the day is A. So if your day start with A, by the time you see this, it's going to be over. But I went and got me a free sub. And then I left there, came laid down. Y'all know after that sun, do a little one-two chop on me, I have to come take me a nap. 
So I just finished up all my work for the day and I'm headed out the door to go try to pick up my package again. So hopefully the package is here and I can get my package. And like I said, once I get the package in the next couple days, I'll be going home. So got my stuff. We headed out the door. I'll check in with y'all in a little while. So I got a surprise. So I'm having a baby. I'm having a baby. I know I hadn't told y'all I know it was a surprise, but y'all know I keep talking about how I was in Jacksonville for two weeks and I was waiting on the package. Well, the package is a baby. I'm having a baby. The baby is supposed to be on the way now. So we are headed out the door to go. Y'all, I got to tell y'all the backstory this baby because we have been waiting. I was supposed to be in Jacksonville for like four days. I have been here now for two weeks waiting on this baby. So let's go out the door and hopefully we about to have a baby. So y'all, we are at the hospital. I don't think y'all told y'all that I came out to the hospital yesterday. Like, I'm just really kind of starting. I couldn't decide if I wanted to vlog about this or not, but I've decided to go ahead and just get the clip. So if I use them, I use them, I don't, I don't. But I'm at the hospital, um, waiting. Well, I'm about to be waiting on my first grandbaby to be born. Um, it has been an overwhelming experience. Um, again, that's why I've been in Jacksonville so long, because I've been waiting on this. Um, I'm at the hospital. We came to the hospital yesterday for what was supposed to be a scheduled induction, but they moved it from yesterday to today. So we're here for this scheduled induction. And yeah, so I got my Stanley cup. I got my computer. I'm getting out. I'm, I don't know. You know, I don't know. I've never, I was never induced. So I don't know how long inductions take, but I know they can't let you go more than 24 hours. But I mean, 24 hours can be to seven o'clock tomorrow. So I don't know how this is going to go, but we've got to find out. So y'all, I don't know how much vlogging I'm going to do up here, but I don't know. So, let's get out. Let's go in. And y'all know I will keep y'all updated. Alright, y'all. It is 9 a.m. She's dilated 2 centimeters. We kind of just wake it up. So, um, yeah. So, we're waiting to see what they're going to do next. I'm probably going home to take me a nap. I've been in this chair my shoulder hurt. So, I'm waiting for them to come back to say what they're going to do next. And then, we will go from there. She's been asleep though. She was snowing and everything. So, she's fine. I hope y'all can hear me. But, yeah. I keep y'all updated. Hey y'all. So, it is hours later. It's like 9 o'clock at night. Um, I don't know if I picked the camera up since this morning, but yeah, I left the hospital this morning at about 10. Um, I went, took me a shower, took me a nap, all of the things, ate and all that. I just went to hookah and now I'm back at the hospital. Last I knew she was dilated four centimeters. So we headed back into the room to check, see what's going on, but it's not about night, so we're probably going to end up having the baby tomorrow, which is the 22nd. So... Let's go in here and check in and see what's going on. All right, y'all, we back up here. Ain't nothing going on. So we're laying here, not doing a thing. She's laying there just like I left her. Just like I left her. This okay, y'all, it is currently 3.05 a.m. We think the water broke at 2. It was about 2.45. I forgot I was supposed to keep y'all updated. Um... We are now, we think, in active labor. We're waiting to be checked um, to see how many centimeters she's dilated and to make sure that her water is broke. But she is in pain, so she is having contractions. So we have a baby on the way. Stay tuned. Okay, y'all, it is currently four. What is that, 14? I can't even tell the time. And she is about to get the epidural. Um, we just waiting on the anesthesiologist to come in. What is all this trash on the floor? Um, yeah. I was just about to take me a nap. I had to put my glasses off and things. And then, everything got kicked into high gear. So, looks like we are having a baby today. I think I already said that, but I just want to let y'all know again. <sighs> oh. Alright, y'all. It is... 7.40 a.m. And we are about to start pushing. I don't know why this camera not focusing. She might have like a four bag that needs to be. 
But we about to start pushing at 7.40 a.m. And... Make sure you get my good side. <laughs> I don't know. All right, Mama, has anybody talked to you about pushing before? Okay, y'all, it's been... Well, I told y'all it was seven. It was what it was like seven forty-five or something like that when we started. It is now nine thirty, and we still pushing. We still pushing. What she said? <laughs> we still pushing. So everything is ready to go. So we're just waiting on the baby to come out at this point. They keep saying they see a mohawk and things, but I ain't seen nothing. We're waiting on the baby. What is coming? Can we turn it off? What do you mean turn it off? Because they dripping it. Oh, y'all didn't do the needle? Well, the needle goes in the back, but like with the spinal first section, it's just medication that lasts for like an hour. But with the epidural, we're talking about the epidural. And it can just keep going. Oh, so she, she only got the, 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 she Big deep breath, right back at it. That same spot. So good. Go, 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 Seven pounds, three ounces. Oh, look at my girl. 
Look at my girl. It's the Nissan Girl of Summer Sales event at Okay, okay, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Send that leave me alone Hey y'all, so I just wanted to come out here and say that when I recorded this video um, for my vlog, I was not sure what I would and I wouldn't be sharing as far as the birth of my granddaughter. Um, since she has been born, I have decided that I will not be sharing her on social media or YouTube, just not yet. Um, her mom and dad have not had a chance to share her or have not shared her on social media. So I don't want to be the one to just blast her out on YouTube like that. So that's why there are a lot of cutout pieces of the birth and then a lot of blurriness in some of the other videos because we're just not ready to share her with the world yet. Um, She is a perfect baby. She is seven pounds, three ounces. She is beautiful. Y'all, she came out looking just like a real person. Like she didn't have to wait a couple days to get her look or nothing. She is beautiful, okay? But I just wanted to share that with you guys just in case you was wondering what happened in the video. Yeah, it's just after I recorded all this, I decided that I was not ready to share her yet. So I hope you enjoyed the rest of the vlog, but I just wanted to stop by to say that. Thank you. Bye. Hey, y'all. So, come on, give me some light. Give me the light. Just give me the light. It is Friday. Um, I'm headed to the hospital to see the baby. I went um home last night or from the hospital. I didn't stay to the hospital. I had stayed to the hospital two nights in a row. And baby, I couldn't sleep in that little recliner chair not another night. So I decided to go home last night. So I'm headed back out there now. I've been wanting me some pancakes, so I just stopped at Cracker Barrel to get me something to eat before I go. Cause I got a bad habit of going to the hospital and then getting out there and being and starving and have to leave and go get me something to eat. Something to get me something to eat before I go today, so I won't have to leave. And then, um, yeah, we're going to see the baby. We're going to see the baby. We are going to see the baby. So, y'all, I think I told y'all that one of my friends bought my Stanley Cup. And I want y'all to know that when everybody was going crazy about these cups, I was so anti-Stanley. I didn't understand what the hype was. Why did people need these cups so bad? I've never had an insulated cup that keep your stuff cold for days like this and stuff. And with it being so hot out here, like, this cup is fucking amazing. Like, girl, I am a Stanley girl, okay? Like, the fact that it's ice still in here. I put this ice in here yesterday. It's still in here. And it ain't melted to turn into water. Like, that is amazing. That is amazing. And I'm sure other cups do this too. But I ain't never, like I said, I've never had one of these cups before. So, I didn't know that this is what they do. But this cup is amazing. It is amazing. I can't wait to get this hospital and get me some of this good hospital crushed ice. That good crushed hospital ice. Oh, yeah. I can't wait to get me some of that and put it in here. Because it lasts for days, okay? But anyway, let's go get these pancakes and... Yeah, let's go eat these pancakes. Good morning, y'all. So we are, it is Saturday morning. And I'm up headed to pick up um the baby uh scroller. Um, I'm about to stop at Target first, which I looked online for Target, and they did not have uh, anything in stock. They didn't have anything with pink on it, so they got a lot of scrollers and stuff in stock, but they all like black and black and gray and stuff. Like, oh uh, yeah. So, that, but I'm gonna stop in here and see. But if not, I know that Walmart has something that I'm looking for, so I'll go to Walmart and get that. Um, but yeah. So let's go to Target. <laughs> Y'all, why the hell do baby bags cost eighty dollars? Like, hell. Even on the lower price side, see it's still sixty dollars. Oh yeah, let's go to Walmart. Cause yeah, that's not gonna work. And they don't have anything I need as far as the scrollers. Cause that's what I came in here for. They only have. I guess it would be like gender neutral. Everything is black. Everything is black. So, and we're not doing that. It need a little bit of pink or something on it. But everything is just all black. And all the ones with pink on them, you have to order them online. And I don't feel like that's fair. So yeah, 
They have anything I need in here. So let's go to Walmart. Okay, y'all, like I said, Target did not have what I was looking for. So now we're gonna go to Walmart. I already ordered it online from Walmart. I just gotta do, I'm gonna just do Walmart pickup. Um, I don't know why I did that though, cause I really wanna go in Walmart and get a couple of other things. Hmm, but I don't know. But we'll go in Walmart, I get what I need. Um, and then I'll take this stuff up into this baby. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going home. I'm supposed to leave here in the morning. I don't know how I'm finna do this. Like, I don't know how I'm finna do this. Like, how am I gonna leave my baby? Like, this baby is so, like... I, I don't think I have really explained to y'all and talked to y'all about what the, the feeling I get with this baby. Like, this baby just... It's like I just wanna just wrap her up in my arms and just... I just want to protect her and I just want to cover her and I just want her to be safe and I just want her to be happy and I just want her to be like y'all I am somebody's grandmother like that is such a big fucking deal like I'm about to cry just thinking about it like I am somebody's grandma and I knew it was something else I knew I did not share with you guys y'all we are fully monetized we are fully, so many good things have happened this week to it. it's crazy we are fully monetized um, we got fully monetized like one day earlier this week. I, I had one goal for June, and my one June goal was to get monetized on its own YouTube, and we did it. So I don't know what that means. I don't know what happens from here, and I really just haven't had time to kind of get myself together because I've been here in Jacksonville. But I'm leaving Jacksonville in the morning. I'm actually I won't be home till Monday, but I am leaving Jacksonville in the morning. So we leaving Jacksonville. So next week we'll be back to our regular schedule, but we just a grandma doing this thing as a grandma you know what i'm saying so i'm headed back um i mean i'm headed to walmart to pick up this roller and then i'm going back to the hospital because the baby should be getting discharged today and yeah i will see you guys in a little bit yeah i have been wanting me a real good waffle like off the broiler on the board like i have been craving a real good waffle with some fresh tomatoes and lettuce and stuff and i had a waffle from burger king the other day i think i told y'all that but it was not what i you know it wasn't what i was looking for and so i'm at burger king again trying this again i want me a good fresh waffle oh if that dr pepper is in the indication of what this waffle finna be <coughs> oh Oh, that just keep me in my throat, okay? I hope that Whopper be just like this Dr. Pepper. I, I really hope this Whopper be just like this Dr. Pepper. Y'all, I just left out of um, Walmart, getting the baby another baby bag, getting her some um, more body wash and stuff. And, Cause I like babies to smell like babies. Like when you pick them up, I like them to smell like a baby. I want you to know that they bathed up and lotion down and that kind of stuff. Do people still do that with their babies? Is my camera focused? Can y'all see me? Thank you. All right, you do the same. Um, it's the older lady at the window, so I got a little faith in this burger. Look, <coughs> burger king fries are disgusting. But anyway, they're good and fresh though. I like for babies to smell like babies. Like, um, I just bought some more body washes though, and um. I'm gonna order her a bunch of like personalized stuff with her name and her initials and stuff on it because y'all know I love that stuff for me. So I'm definitely gonna get it for my girl. But I'm gonna pull right here and eat my food and then I'm going back up here because she should be getting ready to get discharged. So let me eat. Um, I got her baby bonnet too, y'all. Her first baby bonnet. Cause my baby got a head for the hell. And you know, when them babies be sleeping on their head, they roll their hair. So I got her bonnet so we could preserve her hair. So. I'm just buying shit at this point. <laughs> that waffle went good, y'all. Like, <clears throat> I'm not even sure that was a Whopper patty. The patty was so thin, it might have been a patty that gone on like a regular double cheeseburger or something. I don't know what happened to Burger King over the years, but I used to love Burger King. Like, it was like Burger King over everything, but not no more. It just, it ain't right. It ain't right. Now, Dr. Pepper was the best part of this whole meal. I just want to let y'all know, I'm highly disappointed. 
I'm highly disappointed. And I, I'm not giving Burger King not another chance. Mm -mm. I, that, mm -mm. Fool me one time, shame on you. Fool me two times, shame on me. It won't happen again. Okay, y'all. So it is Saturday night. It's like 11.30. I'm so sleepy. Y'all, so today after I got the baby stroller, I went back up to the hospital. Um, put the, We put the stroller together. The baby was discharged from the hospital. Um, Y'all, after that baby was discharged from the hospital, I sat in the parking lot and cried for about five minutes because I'm going to miss my baby. I am going to miss my baby. Like, this is going to be so hard for me. Like, I love this baby so much, y'all. Like, my grandma Mary has been my screensaver on my phone since she died, which was November the 30th, 2022. Today, she lost her spy and I replaced her with my sugar mama. So, yeah, it is, it's, this is gonna be a very difficult thing. I'm leaving tomorrow though, I have to leave. And I'm actually not going home to Monday. Tomorrow is Sunday, so I'm going somewhere else tomorrow. If you wanna see where I'm going, watch my next vlog. Um, I'm going somewhere else tomorrow and then I'll fly home from there on Monday. So I'm packing up all my things. Um, I have everything packed at this point, except what I'm putting on in the morning, which I don't know. What I'm, I think I'm gonna have to run in Target when I get up and find me a shirt because I got some bottoms and I don't really have no top. So that's the plan for in the morning. Get up and run, find me a shirt in Target, turn my rental car in, and then um, head to my next destination. And of course, I'll take y'all with me. We'll be back like full time vlogging as of tomorrow. So we'll be home. We can really pull out the camera, really do some things. Or we'll be gone from Jacksonville so we can really do some things. Um, I'm gonna finish editing a vlog tonight so I can get that up tomorrow. Um, I think I get that vlog up tomorrow. I think I've done one or two more vlogs. I've been here for three weeks, y'all. Three whole weeks. Like, time has went by so fast. I have spent the whole month of June. So I've been here for three weeks. That's 21 days. And then I was, the Philadelphia trip was three days. So that's 21, 24 days. So in the month of June, I was home six days. I have spent six days home in my own house, in my own bed. So we definitely got to spend some time home in July because, baby, rent ain't cheap, okay? But, yeah, I want to come back on here and wrap up this vlog. I hope these vlogs are vlog worthy y'all i keep saying that but like being here in jacksonville is just hard to figure out what i want to vlog what i don't i'm in somebody else's space so i have to be respectful of that and just trying to make sure that everything is you know on the up and up i'm giving you a quality vlog but i'm also being safe i'm also being cautious and things like that so it's been kind of hard so i hope once i edit it that it's good footage that the vlogs are quality they are um long enough to be entertaining and all of the things but y'all already know how i feel if you made it this far in the blog thank you thank you thank you, you know i love y'all because y'all love me don't forget to like and comment on the blog and if you haven't subscribed what the hell are you waiting for until next time bye one one what's the four one one what's the four one one what's the four one one